Hey everyone, it's Riley. Today's video is going to be a vlog because I am trying to prepare for a new hamster. I've got three things to do today. So first I've got to clean out Kirkshanks' old cage. I've got to wipe everything out and sanitize all the toys and everything in the cage. And I've got to make a new multi-chamber hideout because this one is nasty and crusted with pee. It's absolutely disgusting. So I'm throwing it out and making a new one. The cage is sort of in disarray right now because I've already consolidated some things together before I thought to film a video, but it's all going to be clean very soon. So hopefully this video is satisfying and relaxing, and I hope you enjoy it. I made this wooden multi-chamber hideout a long time ago, but I've never properly shown it on YouTube. I'm kind of proud of it because it turned out pretty well in my opinion. I cut the wood and screwed it all together, but my brother had to help me drill the holes in it, which was kind of dangerous because the drill bit was so big and the wood pieces were very small, and we didn't really have anywhere to hold onto the wood while we were drilling, so it wasn't the safest thing, but thankfully we were able to drill it with no injuries, so we must have done something right. Since the cage is all clean, I'm going to move on to wiping down the hamster items. I'm using the Young Living brand Thieves Cleaner to do this, which is made from essential oils, yet it doesn't have a smell to it once it's dry. It's also safe for use around pets, and I really only use this for disinfecting and not so much for regular cage cleans, 
So I personally feel safe using this cleaner on hamster items. I'm sorry if this sounds like an advertisement, it's not. I just feel like this is going to be easier to explain over voiceover and not through text. So here is everything put together and clean. I don't have enough storage in my room for all my hamster items, so I have them in the cage here, somewhat organized. I can't wait to get a new hamster very soon, although I do need to buy bedding and set up the cage before I do that. But thank you very much for watching this video, I hope you liked it.